with Beverly Hillbillies, I wrote of necessity. Uh, the time was coming, it was approaching when we had to do it, and uh, Al Simon had engaged a pair of well-known songwriters, and they came out to Universal, I remember, and did the song for me, and I said, well, I'm sorry, but that's not what, that's not what I want. So, in, uh, I think it was Perry Botkin, who was the first musical director on the Hillbillies. I had uh, pirated a record of Flat and Scruggs, and I used that, and I said, I, I know I can't do that on the air, and he said, well, why don't I go down to Nashville and have them record the, you know, Hire them. Have them play the. So anyway, uh, of necessity, I just made up some words and music and sat down at a piano with a very talented lady. She and her husband were both fine musicians. And I sat beside her on the piano bench and I said, Now I can't write music but I can sing you what I think this should be, and if you'll write it down, we'll, you know. And she said, fine. So I sang the words and the music, and she wrote down the notes. And, and Perry Botkin said, I know just the guy to sing it. And uh, so that's the way it worked out. Jerry Scoggins. Jerry Scoggins had, I think, appeared with uh, Gene Autry uh, as a singer of Western songs. 